And then after powering here, the, there is a sieve, there is a mesh. So honey goes through uh, the mesh. There are so many activities uh, that go on around uh, Chivale National Park. Today we are going to learn about the unique activity that you will find interesting. And maybe when you come to Chivale National Park, you have a community work, community experience, you can enjoy this. Okay, please tell us about the bee activity. Thank you very much. Uh, once again, my name is... My name is Akampulira Odomaru and uh, this time around this is a new product on board. If you have to come to Chiba National Park, expect lots of uh, activities including this, uh, the Api Tourism. Api Tourism is tourism in bees. As we earlier told you, our company is based on conservation and community development. We accepted that. For the more conservation to take place, we need more pollinators and the best pollinator or the first pollinator is bees. So we looked at how basically we can support bees development or happy tourism development around Chivale National Park. Uh, we have our clients uh, dressed in bee suits and then we have to visit the apiary or a place where we collect our beehives and then demonstrate on how we do bee trapping, bee harvesting and honey processing. Uh, we basically do this for the period of two hours and we do it right from uh, 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. because we don't want to interact with bees and then they can end up messing up in the communities. So we always do it late in the evening or very early in the morning. So this is an interesting activity that we go to the beehive, look at how many bees in the beehive, take live pictures without being stung by the bees and finally have the honey processed at our office on your presence, pack it and uh, also um, have to brand it in our names, Chivale Botanical Gardens and Ecotourism Center. We have our products as honey and venom. So this is uh, our honey processing machine. After the bee experience in the field, our clients come and do the honey processing uh, activity. So it opens, so you have to get pure honey, or organic honey you, you brought from the beehive. Uh, chop it using this knife in two small pieces to make sure it fits us very well. Fill it here, and uh, the machine has got two chambers, and then the settling tank. So the first chamber holds the honey from the beehive, or uh, raw honey. And then after powering here, the, there is a sieve, there is a mesh. So honey goes through uh, the mesh and goes to the second chamber. So the second chamber is more fine than the first chamber. So the second chamber now filters the honey to pure honey with no, uh, with no crude. So the settling tank now, all the honey that has been processed here goes down to the settling tank. And finally, finally, on your presence, we have got to pack our honey in your presence. Uh, down here, down here is the tap. So the tap opens. The tap opens and closes. The tap opens and closes. So all the honey that has been processed is kept here. So this is the tap. We have, uh, for example, uh, we have uh, a container. So you have just tap here and then close after it becomes full. So we don't touch honey even a single minute. From the field, you don't touch honey to the machine to the packing material without touching the honey. I can pack the honey without touching it. That means our honey is natural and pure. 
with no ingredient, with no any additive. Thank you very much.